Let's start our journey with the first trimester from week 1 to week 12. In week 1, you're not officially pregnant. This is the week of the start of your last menstrual period. As the uterus sheds its lining and causes bleeding, the hormones are preparing another egg for release. The uterine lining is thickening and ovulation is getting ready to occur. You might feel a twinge of pain as ovulation occurs. This could be the week when an egg is released into your fallopian tube, it meets up with your partner's sperm. During the average ejaculation, around 350 million sperms have a chance at making the trip into the fallopian tube. The ones that make it will wait there for an egg for as long as four days. When the sperm penetrates an egg, fertilization and conception occurs. The fertilized egg is called a zygote. Immediately, the egg begins dividing into identical cells as it floats down the fallopian tube to the uterus. Once the blastocyst arrives during week 4, it will implant itself in the uterine wall and grow for the next 9 months. After fertilization, the blastocyst undergoes the great divide, splitting into two bundles of cells. The inner bundle will become your baby, while the outer bundle will burrow deep into the wall of the uterus to become the placenta. Your baby is elongating from a ball of cells to a tadpole-like shape. All the major and minor systems and organs have to form from scratch. At this week, a primitive heart begins to form. A tube extending from the mouth to the tail of the embryo, and this tube will eventually turn into the stomach, liver, pancreas, esophagus, and intestines. The head are developing into your baby's jaw, cheeks, and chin, which will eventually become one adorable face. Small dots on the face will form the eyes and button nose in a few weeks. Your baby's kidneys, liver and lungs, along with the little heart are taking shape at this week. Your baby is starting to look a little bit cuter, with dark spots that'll become eyes, two holes that will turn into nostrils, the beginning of lips. The limb buds are elongating and will soon become defined shoulders, arms, legs, and knees. The little paddles at the ends are becoming more distinct and will soon develop into tiny fingers and toes. Nerve cells are multiplying and connecting with each other's, they will later transmit messages from the brain to the body. Newly developing cartilage and bones are starting to form. Tiny fingers and toes are just starting to differentiate. The placenta will keep supplying your baby with nourishment and oxygen via the umbilical cord. The diaphragm is nearly fully formed, the liver, spleen, the gallbladder are all under construction now and in a short time will be fully formed. Your baby is really taking a human shape now. Bones and cartilage are forming and small indentations on the legs are developing into knees and ankles. Your baby's eyes are hidden behind sealed lids and won't function until later in the second trimester. Baby's stomach and kidneys are operational now, churning out digestive juices and urine. The arms, complete with elbows, can flex already. The heart is now fully functional with four chambers. Two ventricles pump blood to the lungs and body, while the two atria receive blood from baby circulation. And now, the baby's head has some distinctly human features, with ears now sculpted into their final shape, open nasal passages on the tip of the nose, 
and a tongue and palate in the mouth. Fingernail and toenail beds are developing and nails will actually start forming within the next few weeks. Your baby's thyroid starts to work on its own. The pituitary gland has started producing hormones, and the pancreas has begun to synthesize insulin. If you like the 3D medical animations, don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.